Hey everyone, I'd like to share this tool that I made. It's a time to kill simulator for Destiny. Um, time to kill, or TTK, for those who don't know, is a measure of how quickly a weapon can kill in a first person shooter. In this case, Destiny. So, I'll just run through the um, an example run of this simulator. Uh, so, the first thing it's going to ask is um, it asks for the number of bullets per burst for your weapon. So I'm going to, for example, um, pick a, a 340 RPM pulse rifle. Those have three bullets per burst, so I'm going to enter three. Um, their body shot damage is 22, headshot is 35.2, and RPM is 340. So uh, where the usefulness of this simulator comes in is um, it lets you input your chance to hit a headshot, your chance to hit a body shot, and your chance to miss for any given bullet. Um, and then it simulates 100,000 gunfights against enemy guardians and um, captures the time to kill for each of those gunfights um, where each shot in every one of those gunfights is RNG based on the chances that you enter here. And then it averages the TTK across all of those 100,000 gunfights and it spits out that average. So I'm going to, for example, enter 60% chance to headshot and 30% chance to body shot. And then it's going to assume 10% chance to miss. So it's going to take a few seconds to run the simulation. And then it's going to spit out, in this case, my average TTK is 0.876 seconds. Um, so I wanted to share this tool with everyone in case anyone wants to use it. Um, I think this is useful um, because, so there are, spreadsheets out there like Mercules' spreadsheet here. This is an awesome spreadsheet for those who don't know. Um, I'm gonna link it in the description. But there are spreadsheets like this that show optimal TTK of weapons. So for example, high impact pulses, like the one we just simulated, have an optimal TTK of 0.67 seconds. That assumes every shot is a headshot. Um, this calculator lets you input what your chances are of hitting headshots or body shots or misses. So I think this is useful in that it gives you, in my opinion, a better sense of the average time to kill you're going to have with any given weapon um, across many games. So it lets you know how consistent your weapons are TTK wise. Um, there are, of course, many major limitations to this tool though. Uh, one of which is you have to estimate your accuracy. There's there's no way around this other than, you know, recording all your games and adding up how many of your shots or headshots or body shots or misses. I don't think anybody wants to do that though. Um, so that's one major limitation. Another major limitation um, is the simulator assumes every sh um, every gunfight is begun with you hitting a headshot. So there's a guaranteed initial headshot. This is the source code, by the way. I might as well just uh, show this really quick. Um, it assumes, yeah, the first shot is always a headshot. I did this on purpose. I think it's the most accurate way to go about this. Um, it also assumes accuracy is consistent after the first headshot, so it ignores things like accuracy bloom and flinch. Um, assumes unlimited magazine size. Uh, that's also another limitation. Um, it does, it, it tries to, um, simulate a variety of hit points on the enemy that you're fighting. So um, it most frequently will simulate an enemy guardian that has um, between 186 and 200 hit points um, because that's the hit point, here, here that is, uh, that, those are the hit point values for uh, one resilience to 10 resilience. Um, but it doesn't always assume this. Sometimes it assumes that the person you're fighting is already weak. 35% um, chance of that happening. Um, sometimes it assumes they have an overshield. Um, sometimes it assumes that they activate worm husk mid-fight. Things like that. So, um, and it makes these uh, assumptions based on these percentage chances of these things happening that I sort of came up with based on my own anecdotal experience. So this is another limitation. There's no way that these are all perfectly accurate. This is just my best guess. <clears throat> so anyways, lots of assumptions being made in this simulator, but I do still think it's quite useful. Um, and I wanted to share it. 
it, uh, um, I also made an accompanying spreadsheet for it. <clears throat> so this spreadsheet, pretty much its only purpose is to track the um, body shot, headshot, and RPM numbers for all of the um, primary weapon, weapon archetypes. <coughs> um, I've entered decimal place values for, um, for all of them uh, to the best of my knowledge. Uh, most of these are the most accurate numbers that I'm aware of other than, of course, the ones that Bungie publishes with the TWAB and stuff like that. And then the other per, um, function of this spreadsheet is to keep track of a few specific simulations that I've run. So I've got a column for 33% uh, headshot, 33% body shot, 34% miss, and a column for 60% headshot, 30% body shot, 10% miss. <clears throat> um, and I've just tracked a whole bunch of numbers for these different uh, weapon archetypes. I didn't fill this in completely, but um, just, uh, yeah, so a couple purposes for the spreadsheet. Anyways, uh, I'm going to link this and the simulator um, and Mercury's spreadsheet down in the description, um, and I hope you guys get some use out of them. That's all. Thanks. See ya.